And we have Richard Clink versus Ben. Damn, dude. Richard fucked me, dude. He is he's the well, best. Like, he was he, we had close matches, but like he just like was like I can go anywhere. But uh he is the best Street Fighter player in San Diego and arguably top ten in SoCal. Oh shit. Yeah. He used to be an old school melee player and now that's crazy. He, no, now he's just crazy. fucking around, and he raped you. Get fucked, yeah, James. Yeah, so I got raped. <laughs> I got, uh, what's it called? Too good. Richard's too good. Dude, he, ble- <laughs> he beat uh, Fly Amanita with uh, Ganondorf. Yeah. Bizarro yeah. Flame didn't even do that once. I know. Richard confirmed better than Bizarro. Yeah, he should have uh, been on that trying. Apex main stage and up tilted Bizarro. What is this? Easy. Easy money. Okay, I'll yes. be, you'll be Admiral Falcon. <laughs> oh, sick. Oh. <laughs> you'll be Admiral Clinks. Oh, no, I'm Admiral. He's Captain. He's Captain. Okay. Captain. He's, uh, oh, he... You're... You're Richard's Admiral? Yes. That's so sick. Captain Clinks sounds nice. And now we have a match. So... Ben, pretty good at this matchup, but not great. Hopefully... Clinks knows how to edgeguard Luigi because SJ, SJ did it. not. <laughs> he was like, SJ, you just have to grab the ledge. Yeah. But that's every character with SJ. So, I think he's got this. I know Richard or Clinks has really good pressure. He's really he's really mobile. He's confident. Nice back. That, that was sick. That was a sick move. That was a very good move. Proficient. Shane, you don't play proficient like uh, Richard does. Yeah. Richard's proficient fast. is the word of the day. Really good. Really good on that. Comment on this video wow. and say proficient. He didn't even... even if he traded, oh, it still would have been blocked. sick. That was nice. Nice by Ben. Down throw knee. Probably won't work till like about 40, 50. Is this loser semis? Uh, is this loser semis? All right. I play the winner of this. Okay. Down throw a forward. Down throw yeah. forward smash. So if you don't DI that out, he's just going to F-smash you. And if you DI it out, you're going to get edge guarded most likely. But you can mix up on Luigi. Yeah, you got to mix up so on Luigi. So high percent, usually DI out, like away from Luigi behind him. If you get grabbed. Yeah, don't get grabbed. Although, I don't know. There are things Luigi's can do, like... And that's bad up B. A lot of Luigi's do up throw, up B, sweet spot. The up throw sends, like, Falcon at, like, that perfect angle for follow-ups. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's good. Huh. Those okay. spot dodges, nice. those aren't good. Luigi I'm, on a platform. I think he's much. trying to shield drop. Oh. Ben doesn't know how to shield drop. No, he knows. He knows. It's a. Uh, he he kind of knows. It's interesting to apply. Yeah. Sometimes you can. Your hands will move faster than they usually because you're under pressure. Ben is under pressure. It's crushing down on him. So Falcon, yeah. You can just throw it like pretty low committal moves against high. Uh, high committal characters. <laughs> no, not high committal. I'm saying uh, high Fal- percent Luigi. Man, if you're good at this, sock. if you're good at this matchup with Falcon, it is pretty like daunting for, Lu- for Luigi because yeah. gentleman oh, knee bad. is a confirmed combo. Richard yep. has good tech skill. Unless like, I, I think if you di out gentleman knee, you might be able to get out of it. But you know, moonwalking sure. is kind of like riding a bicycle. Yeah. Yeah. How so? Uh, you'll never forget it. It's ingrained in your muscle memory. Yeah, I feel like a lot of things are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See? I, I mean, I can't. Man, I can't that tech skill. Man, I'm getting scared. What? Oh, Ben didn't win a match. No, no, that was him. Oh, yeah, Ben. Ben with that phantom win. Phantom win. (laughs) S2J with that phantom hit to lose the game. versus Luigi. Ganon can, like, Uh, really wreck Luigi with uh, strong hits. Smart to go Ganon on uh, Yoshi's uh, Island. Or Yoshi's Story. I don't know what this dude is called. Ganon, just a slow guy. You camp him. Gets wrecked. Well, like on but this stage, he, he has. Smarted. Yeah, he has a lot of room, so or not very much room, so you can't really camp him very yeah, efficiently. That, I won't. I don't want to play uh, Yoshi's Island here or Ganon on Yoshi's Island. Good pressure. Wow. Man, I don't know why Ben's picking oh, Yoshi's nice story today. Poke. Well, it baited out the Ganon, so there's that. 
Mm. Luigi on ledge is interesting. Interesting pressure. You can easily is get he gonna like... spike him? I would have spiked him. And he didn't make it anyways. Yeah. I would have still spiked him. Down throw. Nice. Nice down. grab. Didn't commit to edge. Yeah. Nice. I find it better to not challenge Luigi on the edge because he just throws out a lot of stuff and if you make the wrong call, you die. Yeah, I don't like playing Luigi on the ledge. And Porter? No. Nice back air, yeah. Man, that back air is really cool. Oh, nice, and that was nice. A good, uh, that was really what you should do. That was, that was a really safe option, too. Yeah, the risk. that was the optimal thing. Richard's really good at like picking a risk reward ratios. Like yeah. Any risk he takes is not like that risky. And if he if it pays off it's like really pays off. All right, so Luigi pressure. I don't know about it. I think if Ben did Luigi pressure and stayed behind Ganon, then it would do better. But at the same time the Luigi has slow pressure. Oh, <laughs> this fire. It's, that is so you're aggravating. Always gotta be, you're always going to be ready for it. It's not I that feel great for, in this game. I feel for Richard right now. I hate getting hit no, by that. No, you have to be ready for it. It's your fault if you get hit by it. It is not Richard's fault. No, it's, Comment it's your if fault. it's Richard's you fault. Know. You have to be ready always for Miss Fire. Like this video and comment if it's <laughs> Richard's fault or not. Miss Fires are not that threatening, though, because you can just throw out a hitbox. And it'll usually beat it like every time. It is only threatening if uh, it catches you by surprise. But it, the very nature of the move, it is a yeah, random so move. His his hitbox on the missile is really small and it's within his body, so you can hit his head. It's like in his in his chest and belly area. That's where it's like a small hitbox, so you can hit his head before you hit his stomach and you get hit by the green missile. The green missile. The green missile. A bait. The green missile. The green missile. <laughs> we should right. we should have a bait versus a uh, kage. Yeah, a bait versus kage is up next, guys. So yeah, just so stay, stay tuned. <laughs> and that up there. Oh, nice shield. Yep, it has a safe way to get on yeah. stage. Ben is gonna have to clutch it out if he wants to stay in this. Most characters, if you shield the misfire, you can follow up. But Ganon's just a slow dude, so he can't really get to the other side efficiently. And that is the game. Nice. Bad counter pick by Ben. No, 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 no. I think it was alright. Alright, stop the recording. Alright, see you guys.